All right, so the raid just dropped, and we're going to be going through three different little segments. One with LF Rosé, one with Trunks and Amai, and one with a boost character that is not necessarily uh, the new characters. So let's check the information, who they suggest. Uh, we won't use Broly because you might not have Zenkai 7. We'll use EX Krillin, mate. Yeah, we'll use EX Krillin on that for the third run. But yeah, this is the raid. Uh, we're going to jump into it with each individual. Go over it at the end. Obviously, Elifrose is going to be the best, but we'll just see how impressive the other two are. Let's get it. As you saw from uh, the last one and the Rosé one, Rosé does pretty damn well on this. Now the tags that are buffed are Future, Super Warrior, 
Super Saiyan Rose Goku Black, Dragon Ball Chance, uh, Chunks and my Assist, a new unit again. Melee types and powerful opponent. Now, this Krillin is, what, one, one tag? One? That's it. He's not strike based either, so. Yep, uh, Krillin did pretty well for only being one tag. Rose is obviously uh, almost every single tag but Super Warrior. And Trunks and Mai have that 400%. Now, obviously, you want to run Rose if you can because Dragon Ball Chance and you just saw him cream pie even at two stars. So, Rose is the optimal pick. And to go over the rewards, I actually got one of them. I cut it though because I didn't think I get it. Um, you can get the thousand day coins from this on top of whatever else erasers, uh, Z power. I believe it's 50 Z power for each and platinum coins so try to farm up as much as you can uh we still do have some cc we can get from the thousand day celebration coins i know i do at least and if i do that means it's time gated so we go here we check it out boom i just got enough to get one more all right all my cc besides one is gone and then i could buy souls all that then energy and all this crap everyone loves to see see you guys in the next one